it's always hard when you try to put it into any kind of rhetoric, but I mean, the best way that I can put it is I'm not interested in replicating anything. It's more the impressions of things. So when you get an impression of a texture or a color or uh, something that has, you know, survived for decades or centuries, you know, in a remote location under severe conditions, it has a way of fitting in and nestling in. And you can't delineate that literally. You do it intuitively and viscerally. So when I'm up here, I just let myself absorb and be absorbed by everything that's around me. I'm not, I'm not looking for or hunting for an idea or something that's going to be on a, on a uh, surface conscious level. It's always just dumping itself in. It's just, uh, I'm just absorbing it. I can't help it. All I'm after is trying to increase or improve my own ability to observe nature. So if I'm going to make a pine cone, if I, I've been looking at pine cones my whole life. I used to think I know what they look like until I started to make one. And then I had to make a choice about what it is, what quality does this have or characteristic that I, that says pine cone to me, that, that makes me feel it. And so that's what I'm after. That's, that's the quality that I'm trying to bring out or bring into whatever we're working on. And, um, you know, glass has an ability to do that like no other material. Leave them. Easier for me to just grab them like this. See? 